Hi, this is Lou with R&J Ballroom right here in downtown Canton with your ballroom lesson for the week. In this entire video series, we've been concentrating on one thing, mechanics. Very simply, mechanics are body actions that help to create and control steps. In last week's video, we took all three mechanics, hip swing, knees, and ankles, and we learned how to do all three mechanics as a combined movement. In today's video, we'll be applying that movement and applying all of our mechanics to the rumba box. So let's get started. I'm gonna step back just as I always do so you can see my feet. I'm gonna be doing the lead, left foot forward. I start with my hip to the right. I take my left foot and I step forward with a bent knee. I straighten my left knee and activate my right ankle at the same time. I swing my hip to the left. I step to the right with a bent knee. Activate my left ankle, straighten my right knee. Swing my hip to the right. I close my left to my right with a bent knee. I activate my right ankle, straighten my left knee, hip swing to the left. Keeping my hip to the left, I step back with my right foot with a bent knee, activate my left ankle, straighten my right knee, swing my hip to the right. I step to the left with a bent knee. I activate the right ankle, straightening the right knee, left knee, activating the right ankle, straightening the left knee, swing my hip to the left. I close my right foot with a bent knee. I activate my left ankle, straighten my right knee, swing my hip to the left. And that completes the rumba box. Bend, activate and straighten, swing. 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 As you can tell, this is a much more challenging movement, combining or using, applying all of my mechanics to my rumba box. So here's what I want you to do. Practice slowly. Keep watching this video, but practice slowly. Don't use music. Don't try to do it up to any kind of a tempo. Do each movement in your rumba box and apply these mechanics to those rumba movements. Pay attention to what you're doing. Think about what you're doing with each step you take. When do I activate my ankle? When do I straighten my knee? When do I hip swing? When do I take my next step? Very simple. If you have any problems, stop. Correct what you've done. How did it feel? How does it feel? Am I doing this right? Am I not doing it right? Keep watching the video to keep reviewing and reinforcing what you're doing. And then practice, practice, practice. I guarantee you, if you invest some time, if you invest some effort into doing this, you will increase your confidence and you'll look great on the dance floor. If you have any questions, call the studio. Or if you want any information about R&J Ballroom right here in Canton, call us. Area code 330-510-1370. We'll be happy to talk to you. And guess what? If you mention you saw this video when you call, I'll give you a free private lesson. I'd love to have you here at the studio. So keep dancing and we will see you soon.